Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is a review of the Duo Boots brand. So this is one that I mentioned on my Brands I'd Love to Try video a couple of months ago. They make wide calf boots, or they in fact make knee boots for lots of different calf sizes, ranging from really, really small up until larger sizes. And I was really keen to try this because I've had real issues trying to find knee boots that actually fit my calves. So the first thing I did was measure the widest part of my calf measure the circumference just with a regular fabric tape measure. So I did this at home, I measured it to be 41 inches, I'm not sure that is in centimetres so I'll put it on the screen. I then went onto the Duo Boots website and I had a look at the different sizes they offer. I think they offer about 8 to 10 different calf sizes. They offered a 41 which was my measurement but they do recommend sizing up to the nearest whole size above your measurement because obviously you do want a little bit of give, a little bit of room especially if you want to wear things like leggings tights jeans trousers underneath your boots so I went with the next size up which was actually a 44 inch and I ordered three different styles of their boots to try and test out for myself and for you guys as well I'm really intrigued to see if these fit if the quality is good if I like the style of them because I would love to own things like the Cezanne knee boots or the Rouge knee boots but those ones just don't fit me so I really hope these are a good alternative alternative. I should mention they also come in different heights so if you're petite or taller than average you can get a longer or a shorter boot as well so they really do cater hopefully for every size every height every shape and I love promoting brands like that on my channel so I'm really excited to do this try on for you today. As I said I ordered three different pairs partly because I wanted to try a few for you and myself and also I just could not decide which ones I liked best which ones I'd get the most wear out of so I've ordered one pair of flat boots. I've ordered two pairs of boots with heel with a heel and I've ordered two suede and one leather so I can kind of test out a little bit of everything. They do have some really beautiful styles as I said they've got leather, they've got suede, they've got different colours as well so they have some navy, some burgundy, some green and then traditional browns and blacks as well. They all look beautiful on the website and they're all handmade in Portugal as well so the quality is really high and they're not a fast fashion brand, they are more of that slower brand that really takes the time to put effort and money into the craftsmanship and the materials as well. They're all 100% leather and they range from about just under £200. You can get some on sale for about the £150 mark up until about £250-£300 depending on the style, how much leather is involved etc. So that's kind of all the information I feel like you need to know. I will leave the link to Duo Boots down below. This isn't sponsored at all. I don't make any money from the links. I just really wanted to share this information with you. Um, uh, so let's get started. I'm gonna go with the most classic pair first and that is the black leather. So these are them. They come in really nice packaging, the box, and they've got lots of tissue paper and foam inside so the boots retain their shape during transport. And you can keep those foam inserts so as you're storing the boots when you're not wearing them, they're not gonna lose their shape. As I said, these are the first pair I ordered. So they're a really classic boot. They're a black leather pair with a block heel, probably about three inches high. Um, and as you can see, they are wider on first inspection than a regular pair of knee boots you can see that they actually do come out quite high uh, quite wide sorry on the side so hopefully they will fit my calves um yeah I mean they smell like leather they feel beautifully made the zips are all really lovely they've got a little bit of branding on the zip it just says duo and they do have a little bit of give in them if you can see that so they've got this panel that stretches a little bit so I imagine if you're in between sizes or you need a little bit more give say you want to wear a pair of jeans underneath and they kind of you need that little bit of stretch then it is there as well so that is good to know I'm very hopeful so I'm going to go try them on and let you know what I think Okay, I'm gonna put a cutaway here so you can see the full length of my outfit with the boots. As you can see, they fit perfectly. They zipped up beautifully, no catching on my skin, no kind of being really tight as I got further up my leg, which so often happens for me with knee boots. I don't know if you can relate. Um, but yeah, they fit lovely and they are so comfortable. The size I went with was a UK six. So I'm between a five and a six typically. They don't do half sizes, so I went up. I always find in boots, it's safer to go up 
slightly than to go down because you're going to be wearing tights, socks, etc. So they fit really well in terms of the shoe size. I got the regular height because I'm five foot five and I got the 44 inch calf. They go all the way up to a 50 inch calf. So if you do have bigger calves than me, then you can still find the boots on their website. Equally, they go all the way down to, I think, a 30 inch or something like that. So if you've got tiny calves, you'll be able to find some that fit you and don't fall down as well. So that is really great. And on first inspection, I absolutely love them. They're exactly what I was looking for. A classic pair of timeless black leather knee boots with a block heel. These are something I feel like has been missing in my wardrobe for about the past 20 years. <laughs> um, so kind of basically since I started being interested in fashion, these are so timeless. You see these worn in every decade. And yeah, I think these are a beautiful, beautiful pair. Next up, we have two pairs of suede boots. I'm going to go with the flat version first. So this is them. I got them in this gorgeous green colour just because I absolutely love this forest green colour. I think it's beautiful. I love earthy tones. I love that more muted colour and I just I just couldn't resist these. They were a bit different, a bit more unique than a traditional black or brown pair. They are a suede as you can see. They feel gorgeous and they smell lovely as well. Um, I got these in exactly the same size, the UK sick, the regular height and the calf width 44. So hopefully they fit equally as well as the black pair. These come in a few different colours. They do come in a leather as well, like the same style, but in black leather. They also come in a brown suede, I think, and a couple of different options. So you don't have to go for the green if that's not your thing. But yeah, I love the green. So I'm really excited to try these on. So these also fit really well. I will say these are a bit bigger around the calf than the black pair. So the black pair fit pretty true to size in that they were fairly tight on my calf, but not uncomfortably tight. They just felt like the right size. These still feel really wearable, but there's a little little bit more gaping around kind of the calf. I could probably fit a thicker jean or trouser under these. Whereas with the black ones, I could probably only fit like a tight or a legging or something quite thin. So that's something to bear in mind. I would say these, these run more generous, but they're still not too big for me. So I would definitely, if I was going to keep these, I'd definitely keep this size and I wouldn't size down um, because I like the idea, especially with the flat boots of tucking jeans into them. And obviously I'm going to need more room to do that. So I actually think that's a bit of a pro for me, but it does depend on what you're looking for if you want something really tight then maybe on with the flat style or this style in particular you could go slightly smaller on the calf measurement these look really gorgeous i love the green color these are probably my favorite um and being flat they are slightly more wearable sometimes i just don't feel like wearing a heel i love the look of a heel but walking about a lot i would like to have the option of having a completely flat and comfortable pair that i can do kind of a lot of steps around the city in so these are definitely a good option for that and yeah the green is just so so lovely and just a little bit more unique the final pair I have are another suede pair and they are these brown suede ones with a heel. These remind me of some that I saw on Cezanne and I love that these are like a really good wide calf dupe for those. So they are very similar to the first two pair. They're like an amalgamation of the first two. They've got the heel. It's the same heel height as the um, black leather pair and then they're in the brown suede. They do have this little buckle detail that the others didn't have um, and they do also have that stretchy panel as well where which the black pair had, but the green pair didn't have. So maybe that's why they're cut a bit bigger because they don't have this little bit of stretch. I'm not sure. Um, but otherwise they're very similar. These ones I got on sale and I think they may still be on sale. So have a look because I think I got these for about 145 or something like that, which for a pair of knee suede handmade in Portugal boots that look lovely quality and that actually fit, I think is a steal. So definitely have a look at their sale because they do have a few of their styles currently marked down. And yeah, these I think are going to be the most wearable for me. I love suede. I think I prefer it to the leather. I just think it's more my style. I love that 70s feel, that very feminine style. And I think with a dress like this, the brown suede with the heel is going to look the best, potentially. I love that these also have a little bit of like, can you see this? Um, I'm not sure what to call this braiding, I would call it, um, down here. So all the attentions to detail are really beautiful on all of these boots. So let me try these on for you. Wow, okay, I love these as well. 
I'm gonna have such a hard time trying to decide which pair to keep. These, like I said, I think are the ones I'd potentially get the most wear out of. Probably between these and the green ones actually, because the green ones are flat, but these I think will go with everything in my wardrobe. Being a brown classic suede boot, I love the suede, I love the heel, I think it's a little bit more flattering and elongating obviously than the flat boot, but I love them all. And these ones fit very similarly to the black leather pair, so they're not as loose around the calf as the green pair, they fit really well, but they do have that stretchy panel if you need a little bit more give. Overall, I am so impressed with these boots and this brand. I absolutely love them. I feel like they're gonna be my go-to brand if I ever want another pair of knee boots in another style. They also do some ankle boots as well if you're looking for those. And I just think it's so great that they're catering for really small sizes and larger sizes and everyone in between as well. Because even if you've got a regular calf size, you might find that you need an inch more than a regular high street brand or an inch less. And it just allows you to find that perfect tailored fit. It's perfect for you and personalized to your body, which I think is really nice. And I feel like more brands should be taking this approach because we're all a little bit different in our measurements and our, yeah, our bodies. So that is the video. I really hope you enjoyed it. I hope you find it useful if you've been looking at this brand for a while. I know a few of you mentioned to me that you were interested in trying this brand, but you weren't quite sure how it worked. Hopefully this has made it kind of clear how the, how the system works. It is really simple. They ship to like Europe, America, I think Australia as well, and definitely the UK so you can get some boots and you can return them if they don't work out for you. Let me know which pair was your favourite, which ones do you think I should keep because I only really want to keep one pair. It's kind of silly to keep all three as much as I love them all so let me know which are your favourite. I'm leaning towards the brown suede ones with the heel, I think those are my favourite but yeah let me know. I do love them all though and they all have their own uses in a wardrobe for sure. Give this video a like if you did enjoy it and subscribe to my channel if you would like to see more videos like this. I've got lots more coming for you this year. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a lovely day and I'll see you very soon in my next video.